Hi guys, welcome to Adam McCola TV. This is another match day vlog. Now I promise I was at the game today. In fact, I've just got back from the game. The thing is, I forgot to record my intro before the game of this match day vlog. So here's my intro. Manchester United's trip to Bournemouth. We needed to bounce back from that defeat against West Bromwich Albion at Old Trafford. And with Tottenham up next in a semi-final at Wembley United, needed to get three points, needed to get some confidence back. And we did just that. Here's how my day unfolded. Football talk by Matt Monday on Manchester. Manchester United. Watch your bouncing balls be boobs. They deserve to be united. When they're playing, it's up. Take a lesson, you will see. We talk the cup, Chelsea too. What we like most is kicking up blue, kicking up blue, elite, elite. Oh, oh. 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 Football top by Matt Busbeal, Manchester, Manchester United. Bunch of bouncing Busby babes. When they're playing, you tell. Take a lesson, you will see. Football top by Matt Busbeal, Manchester. Manchester United. Take a lesson, you will see. Oh, Manchester. Manchester United. Bunch of bouncing Busby babes. They deserve to be united. When they're playing in your town. Take a lesson, you will see. They deserve to be united when they're playing in your town. Take a lesson, you will see. Oh, Manchester, Manchester United, put your bounce in both of us. When they're playing in your town. by Matt Busby or Manchester. Number six, Georgie Best. Number seven, Georgie Best. Number eight, Georgie Best. Number nine was Georgie Best. Number ten, Georgie Best. Number eleven was Georgie Best. And number twelve was Georgie Best. We all live in a Georgie Best world. Georgie Best world. Georgie Best world. We all live in a Georgie Best world. Whoa! Oh! She said it's for your life and I'm going to Wembley. Wembley! Wembley! We're the famous man United and I'm going to Wembley. Wembley! United 1, Bournemouth 0. Some decent football. We got into it a little bit slowly, but once we got into it, I think that we're getting in the final third. We're looking a lot better. Um, the goal was a great bit of play. Herrera finding Lingard. Lingard putting it back. I thought Rashford poking it in, but it was Chrissy Smalling. I told you he's always out of position. There's room for improvement, but it hasn't been too bad for United. And hopefully a few more goals, clean sheet, second half. That'll do me. And he's big and he's black, and he plays at the back, and he's smaller than MUFC. Smaller 
Smolin, Smolin, Smolin! Leeds come! A Man City! We ain't Liverpool, a man city. We ain't Liverpool, a man city. Elite, we all ain't Leeds scum. A man city. A man city. Elite! Fuck off! Grub, 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 hello! Man United's number nine. That's Jesse starting against Tottenham. On the left, he scores goals galore. He scores goals. He scores goals galore. He scores goals. Paul scores. He scores goals. Jose sells this geezer. Fuck him. <laughs> So I just finished fan cams here at Dean Court. Uh, Manchester United 2-0 winners on the day. Um, 
decent performance. I'm not going to say very good. It wasn't very good at all. It was a decent performance by Manchester United. I thought we played pretty well from start to finish, although in the early parts of the game, Bournemouth did keep us pretty quiet and they kept closing everything down. Uh, but we got better as the game progressed um, and we created some very, very good chances. I mean, the goal itself, great play by Ander Herrera, Jesse Lingard, Marcus Rashford and winning the ball back. And then we cut the ball back to Chris Smalling who scores. Second half, Romelu Lukaku wraps up the three points. But I thought there were good performances for the likes of Martial, Rashford, Luke Shaw. Um, it was nice to see Daly Blind back. I thought Damian had a bad game today. Always out of position. Always leaving under Herrera with a little bit extra work to do. And that was really frustrating. But yeah, it was a decent performance by Manchester United today. We've got the three points in the bag. And now we move on to that game at Wembley against Tottenham. And that is a big, big game for Manchester United. We'll see probably about six, seven changes from the team that played here today. I know that Jose Mourinho said some of these players could play their way into the semi-final team. Yada, yada, yada. But I don't think that's going to happen. Pogba came off as a sub, Herrera came off as a sub, Jesse Lingard came off as a sub and apart from Smalling and De Gea, I think those from today's starting lineup, those five may be the only five that start at the weekend. So very interesting from Manchester United um, in terms of what the team will be at Wembley and all that but it's nice to get a little bit of confidence back under our belts, a clean sheet, two goals, Romelu Lukaku has got his highest goal scoring tally ever, ever at Everton, West Brom, Chelsea, wherever, in his first season at Manchester United, he's got his best ever goal scoring tally. And now he's on the way to 30. Fingers crossed he can do it because Latin was so close last season and then he picked up an injury. Let's hope Romelu Lukaku don't share the same fate. Anyway, guys, make sure you're subscribing, liking, sharing. And as I said, we've just done fan cams for Full Time Devils. So if you haven't seen those already and you somehow subscribe to me but not Full Time Devils, then head over there, subscribe to Full Time Devils, get on the fan cams, get your comments in. And for now, I'm Adam McCola. I'm out of here.